Can I share something with you? I forget which year it was. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. But I believe it was around the time when I was trying to change. This may sound crazy and you may believe I am crazy and you probably wouldn't be the first <laughs> to think that. But anyways, around that time, I believe I could feel some things coming out of me as if something was coming out of me. Maybe two or three times, maybe two or three times, maybe two times, it felt like for, I don't know how long, but longer than the other ones, I believe, it felt like something really big was coming out of me. What? Maybe two or three times, it felt like something big was coming out of me. And you may say, Kevin, that is your mind. Your mind is playing tricks on you. Okay. If something happened one time, okay, maybe I can say that was probably my imagination. But I believe the number of times when I felt like something was coming out of me, I think that happened many times. And if you know what I am talking about, when, when, I believe there was one that was, that felt longer than the others. I believe there was one where something, where I believe something came out of me that took longer than the others, if you know what I mean. Now, if something like that or close to it continues to happen, I don't think you can say that is coincidental, can you? Okay. I believe those were demons coming out of me. Back in my past, I was very bad. I was rude. I was mean. I was disrespectful. I was bitter. I was hateful. I had depression. So who knows how many demons I had in me. Hopefully, I don't have any more in me. I hope so. Some people may want to know how to get demons out of them. And I may be wrong about this, but let me say it anyway. Try to do what is right. If it is true, those were demons coming out of me, which I am telling you when that large one, whatever it was that it felt like it left my body, I think that was a very strange sensation. I am telling you, very strange, I think. It has been a while now, so I don't remember totally everything that happened, but I believe it felt like something was leaving me. Like I felt a physical sensation or whatever, I guess, of something leaving me or something. So to get back to my point, if you know you have demons, Okay, try to do what is right. And I believe, and I can be wrong about this, I can be wrong about this, but if you try to apply 
the Bible to your life, I believe demons will begin leaving you. You can fast as well, or you, you may believe you can't fast, but try to fast. Let me say it like that. I believe fasting will help you as well. You may say to me, Kevin, I don't know. I'd rather have someone pray them out and stuff like that. Okay, let me ask you this. How did they get in you in the first place? Maybe based upon the stuff that you have done. Maybe because of generational curses or whatever, but probably partly due to what you have done. Okay, let's say you have someone pray for you and let's say they cast out all the demons, but let's say you still have that mentality to purposely do wrong. What do you believe is going to happen? I believe those demons plus more will come in you, right? Please listen to what I am saying. Yes, I wish there was an easy way to live for God. Yes, I wish there was like, I wish this life was easy, but don't be lazy. Put in the work. Yes, trying to do right by God I believe it was, and still is, I think, not easy for me. But I believe if you try to do what is right, it may not happen all at once. I believe if you are anything like me, and if that was demons I was feeling coming out of me, I believe if you try to do what is right, demons will begin to leave you. Okay, if I had a demon of anger and I am trying to push away that anger and I am living, trying to live by God's word and not giving into my anger, what do you believe is going to happen? Perhaps a demon or demons of anger may leave. But if I am constantly giving in, I guess you can say feeding into those demons of anger, what is going to happen? I believe they are going to stay there and get stronger. I may be wrong about this, but I believe that is true. So don't give in. I believe the more you don't give in, the easier it will be to resist. At least I think that is how it is for me. All right. Let me stop here. God bless you.